accounting in German is so strange. I don't think so. I find the US American or French way of counting much funnier. But let's take a look at what's so funny about counting. In Germany, we use Indian Arabic numbers. This wasn't always the case because in the Middle Ages, Roman numerals were still used for counting, even though Arabic numerals were introduced to Spain by the Moors and arithmetic became much easier. From the 16th century onwards, Indian Arabic numbers were used almost exclusively. This made written arithmetic easier as we know it today. When children count with their fingers, this is how we typically do it in Germany. People used to count to 12 on one hand. Even in Mesopotamia, people counted in this way and the day was divided in 12 parts, just like the night. In Germany, 12 pieces are also called a Dutzend Dozen and five Dozen were a shock. And if you buy in bulk or en gros, you buy 12 times 12, that means 144 pieces. This even said to have been a mass or großes gro, which means 12 gro or 12 times 144 or 1728 pieces. What seems strange to some is the naming of the numbers between 20 and 100. Here the Germans say ein und 20, literally 1 and 20 and not 20 and 1. Let's take a look at this in comparison. We can see that in all four languages the numbers up to 12 have their own designation for the counting method used in the past. Spanish also has its own words up to 15 and French up to 60. Both languages have then the 10 in front when counting. 16, 17, 18, 19, or 17, 18, 19. English, however, has the 10 at the back. 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. Just as German has 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19. If we now exceed 20, this remains the same in German. Ein und 20. But in English, it suddenly changes to 21. We are actually only consistent here and the English are inconsistent. What is perhaps unfamiliar but unproblematic, the next point is a very dangerous if you make a mistake. If you listen to the US news as a German, you hear about billionaires and how many there are in Germany, there are only a few milliardaires. Suddenly you realize that the American billion is worth much less than the German billion. And here you can deliberately say the American billion because the British also used the milliard until 1975. But why is that? In 1484, the French mathematician Nicolas Chouquet wrote his work Triparti en la science de nombre and describes the large numbers as échelle long or long scale. He based this on the million and its powers where the numbers are also written in groups of six. One million to the power of zero is one. One million to the power of one is one million and one million of the power of two is 1 billion and 1 million of the power of 3 is 1 trillion. High 1 was a million, high 2 was a billion, high 3 was a trillion. Thus the designation of the numbers automatically has a relationship to the power. The ending Arde or Yard was placed in between. This is a milliard, this is a billiard and this is a trilliard. In the 17th century, the current notation with groups of three was introduced in Italy and France for better legibility as échelle corte or short scale. The powers of the thousands were now used as here. 
1000 powered by 0 is 1. 1000 powered by 1 is 1000. 1000 powered by 2 is 1 million. 1000 powered by 3 is 1 billion. 1000 pow powered by 4 is 1 trillion. The million is now the thousand of the power of 2. 3 is now the billion and 4 is a trillion. While this became popular in France and Italy, it is no longer used there. Conversely, the short scale became established in the English-speaking world in 1975 with England, Australia and the US. It is also used in Brazil, parts of Africa and Arabia, as well as Eastern Europe and Russia. In Europe and Spanish-speaking South and Central America, the long scale is used. In Canada, the long scale is used in the French part and the short scale in the English part. Which scale do you use? Please write in the comments. A number word is sometimes pronounced differently. In German, the zwei, two, is sometimes pronounced as zwo in radio traffic, though that is not confused with a drei, three. I did say the numbers in Germany are consistent and logical, didn't I? Thank you very much for your attention. I'm counting on you the next time.